I have some beautiful Wildlife Wednesday photos to share with you. Look at this amazing shot. I'll move out of the way so you can enjoy the whole thing from Annie Fluger. A uh, moose in the mist, she calls this. A gorgeous, foggy morning at the Kootenai National Wildlife Refuge. Thank you so much, uh, Annie. Now down to the Turnbull National Wildlife Refuge. And Courtney Litwin, she found this muskrat feasting on duckweed. That's what this uh, very bright green substance is uh, and sort of posing on the uh, rock for look at the toenails on this muskrat and uh, Courtney found some other uh, great uh, birds down in the Turnbull National Wildlife Refuge. I'll have those posted on my Facebook here in about 10 minutes. Meanwhile, Paul Webster just today uh, took this picture of a bald eagle at Fernand Lake getting ready to take off. Great shot, Paul. And finally, humongous elk, seven-point elk uh, from Christine Bouillon. And uh, trying to get the velvet off, looks like he got a branch uh, stuck in the rack there and was having a heck of a time, Christine says, getting that out of the antlers. And this is from uh, Stem Milt Hill in Wenatchee. And uh, massive animal there. Here's a look at our satellite and radar. We have some high clouds drifting through right now. Also a little bit of additional smoke uh, as a cold front pushes its way through, picking up our winds, and it is going to cool things down. It is a dry cold front, however, no precipitation in association with this system. Tomorrow we are going to see about a 10 degree drop in our temperatures from the 80s today to the 70s uh, tomorrow. And then that's where we're going to stay through the weekend with dry conditions, occasionally uh, windy. Here's a look at our national satellite and radar. Boy, dry throughout the entire western United States. Little bit of uh, severe weather. One severe thunderstorm just north of Scranton. Uh, high temperatures across the nation. You can see where our cold front is now. 92 for a high in Pittsburgh, 76 in Chicago, 72 in Minneapolis, and 77 in Kansas City, right down the road, 90 in Oklahoma City, 77 today in Seattle, and 89 in Portland. Here's your seven-day forecast. Back to school for many kids tomorrow with 73 degrees, 71 on Friday, and we'll be in the mid-70s through Labor Day. Looks like we're going to be staying dry on Labor Day with just a slight chance of some mountain showers. Keith?